Hey everyone, Steph here from Old Guy Melts Plastic. Uh, in part two of my Annex Engineering K3 build, uh, I'm going to install the four linear rails on the underside of the top extrusions. Now, uh, the in build instructions call for preloading some uh, ball spring T-nuts, and they look kind of like this. They come in a couple of different varieties for M5 screws or for M3 screws, and they have a little ball on the side, on the bottom uh, that is spring-loaded, and hence ball spring T-nuts. Um, they're used to basically screw in, give you something to screw into in the extrusion slots here. Um, so I've preloaded a number of those. Uh, the build instructions do call for an M5 uh, T-nut on the end in the corners, and then M3 T-nuts throughout. Um, and we're going to basically attach one linear rail to the underside of each of these top extrusions so the frame currently is flipped upside down. Um, and we're going to secure them with some M3 by 8 socket head uh, cap screws. And to make sure that the rail is properly aligned on the extrusion, we're going to use these little printed uh, tools to help align the rail on the extrusion. So this slide on like that and it just make sure make sure that the rail is in the appropriate um, par running basically parallel to the extrusion itself. Um, and to further lock everything down we're going to be using some of this VC3 uh, thread locker on the M3 by 8 screws um, to make sure that they don't uh, loosen as the printer vibrates uh, over usage. So Going to get started on that, and again, we're going to go to time lapse mode. Um, so I'll see you on the other side.
All right, so there you have it. I've mounted all four linear rails to the underside of the top extrusions. So when the printer is standing on its feet, they'll be up here. And they're all working pretty smoothly at the moment. Um, these rails did come, um, I've, I've pre-lubricated them, so they're, they're ready to go. Um, I wasn't going to go through this video how to lubricate rails properly, clean and lubricate them, but uh, I've given them the treatment so they're, they're basically ready to go. Um, and next we'll be moving on to the X gantry. See you in the next video.